Damn. Damn, boy. Damn, boy, he's thick, boy. That's a thick ass boy. Damn. PlayStation 5, the PlayStation 5 Digital Edition, the Xbox Series S and X are almost here. We literally got like, what, about a month from now? Yeah. So finally, Sony has come out with their own teardown version of their console. The video is in Japanese, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to cut on the subtitles. I hope everybody got their showering guns on. I'll also be leaving the video in the description below so y'all can check it out for yourselves. And at the end of the video, I will be giving my full thoughts on what's going on with the console. So stay tuned for that. And uh, yeah, let's get into it. Man, I'm, I'm really excited about this. Finally, we get a little bit more information about the console, you know? PlayStation 5, tear down, boy. Let's go. Let's get it. PlayStation 5. Yashishiro Utori. オクユキに百六十ミリと、ユースポーより一回り大きくすることにより、処理能力や静音性の面で規約的な性能向上を実現しました。オッケー、オッケー。フロント側にはUSB、Type-C ポートとハイスピードUSB対応のタイプAポート
次に w i f i 6と Bluetooth5.1 のアンテナにつながるケーブルを外しますシールド板を外します Man, everything looks so technical, man. CPU は、The、CPU. 8コア16スレッドで、最大 3.5GHz で駆動します。GPU は、最大 2.23GHz で駆動し、10.3TF を実現します。テラフラップメモリーは GDDR6 を8個搭載しバンド幅は最大で毎秒 448GB です GB ストレージは HDD に代わり 825GB の SSD をオンボードで実装しています、right. カスタムの SSD コントローラーにより読み込み速度は生データの転送速度で毎秒 5.5GB と高速化されゲームのロード時間を大幅に短縮しています。Yeah. PS5 の SOC は小型の台を非常に高いクロックで動作させています。このため、シリコン台の熱密度が非常に高くなり、SOC とヒートシンクの間に挟む、TIM と呼ばれる熱伝導材の大幅な性能アップが必要でした。<笑> PS5 では、長期で安定した高い冷却性能を実現するため、so、この機体金属を採用しました。我々は2年以上前からこの液体金属を採用するための準備をしてきました。Wow. 考えうるありとあらゆる試験を実施し、採用に至っています。The PlayStation, man, this generation of consoles have become more like PCs than ever. PS5 のヒートシンクです。Heat sink? Okay. That looks cool. PS3 や PS4 と同じくヒートパイプを使っていますが、形状やエアフローの工夫により、ベーパーチャンバーと同等の性能を実現しました。これが定格三百五十ワットの電源ユニットです。Okay, got you. That's the battery. battery. So he's taking off the front little thing. Whoa! Beautiful. これがプレイステーションファイブの全部入りです。All the PlayStation Five parts. Got you. Is that it? Is, all, is that all we get? So here is, is exactly what the PlayStation 5 looks like all tore down. Like I said earlier in the video, this is basically consoles have turned into PCs with the liquid cooling and all that good stuff. But、uh, look here. Let me, th this, this thing is going to be a thick boy. The PlayStation 5 is going to be a thick boy at 104 millimeters wide, 390 millimeters high, 260 millimeters deep. The size is larger than the PS4. I'm glad that it's larger than the PS4. I have my PS4 right here because the PS4 sounds like a jet engine taking off, going into space. You know what I'm, you know what I'm talking about. And also, I think what's going to not necessarily get on my nerves, but it's going to be a little bit of a, a pet peeve of how I want to set up my stuff. The stand, I have to hold it, I have to put this, the PlayStation 5, on a stand in order to have it horizontally or vertically. That's the only way we're gonna be able to、uh, have the stand. Like, you can't just sit on the side, but that's because of the design of the PlayStation 5. So, that might be a little bit of a pet peeve. You know, I mean, we'll see. What I think is gonna be good for the PlayStation 5 is gonna be way more customizable than ever. If we're able to, since we're able to take these、uh, side panels off, You can take it off. You can paint them how you want them. You can get somebody else to paint them how you want them. PlayStation is obviously going to come out with their own,、um, you know, additions for each game. Like they might have a God of War edition, Spider Man, Miles Morales edition, PlayStation 5. You know what I'm saying? So that'll give the PlayStation 5 a little bit more customizability for the consumer. But yeah, that looks like everything that we needed to see finally. We got PlayStation to come out with their own teardown. That was kind of weird that PlayStation came out with their own teardown instead of、uh, giving it to YouTubers. But、uh, I don't know. Would I have rather seen the UI over the teardown of the PlayStation 5?、Uh, probably so, because I'm not really that, that technical 
of a gamer. I, if it works, it works. You know what I'm saying? I don't really care about the insides and all that type of stuff. But the UI has to be next. The PlayStation 5 and the PlayStation 5 Digital Edition comes out literally next month. I know you're excited. I'm excited. So uh, go ahead and drop a like on the video. Subscribe if you're new. And if you're already subscribed to the channel, I appreciate all the things that you do. Watch my videos and all that good stuff. So I guess I'll see you all in the next video. Peace.